Hey guys, I don't even know how to start a vlog anymore. We're back. I look like a mess. <laughs> I just came back from the gym. Hello, welcome back. I'm now back at uni. So that means that the weekly uni vlogs are back. So this is officially week two of uni. I kind of um, ignored week one, just pretended it didn't exist. So this is like week one, but week two, if that makes sense. I went to the gym, did some posts and stuff that was due today. I'm gonna have a shower because I stink. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> I literally, like, I'm not a smelly person. <laughs> I put deodorant on, but I must have worked really hard at the gym or something. I don't know. Um, so I'm gonna have a shower and then I'm gonna do some uni. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for my week. I hope you guys enjoy. I feel like it's been a really long time since we've done this. So if I'm a little bit rusty, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah. Let's get into it. So guys, um, what I'm doing is I'm just, because I went to Fred again last week, I didn't attend my uni classes. How one night affected three days, I've got no idea. But um, so I'm just catching up on last week's property seminar. So I'm just like answering all the questions. I really like um, how this class is structured. Don't like the work, I don't understand it, but I think I'll get the hang of it just the subject kind of tickles the way that I learn, so I'm kind of happy with it. Hi guys, so, so, so sorry to interrupt the vlog, but I promise you it's worth it. I'm just hopping in to tell you guys I'm about to show you some of my favourite uni outfits from White Fox. These are all pieces that I think would be perfect in your wardrobe. They're pieces that you can mix and match with so many different like pants and tops and jackets, all that stuff. Hope you guys enjoy. As always, Ruby XO to save 15% off. Please use my code. White Fox do offer express worldwide shipping and they do offer afterpay for all Australian, US and New Zealand customers. Let's get right into the haul. Cardigans are 100% in. Like this style of top, I'm literally seeing all over my free page on TikTok, non-stop, especially red ones. Oh, going on replay, long sleeve top, obsessed with this. I love the color first of all, just like that perfect like neutral color. It's giving, I can mix and match it. I paired it up with the with you jeans, my go-to jeans. If you guys haven't seen me wear these jeans, you must have just clicked on my video and have never seen me before because I highly live in these jeans. I probably would wear this with black, to be honest. I'm not sure about it with blue. Like, it's still a vibe, but I think black jeans would be the way to go. Fashion Society jeans are... I feel like this is definitely a uh, the weather is cooled down a little bit type of outfit. It's just so cute. I'm really vibing with this. I kind of don't want to take it off. Also, look at the material. Like, it's so soft, but not like... It looks like it should be scratchy, but it's not scratchy at all. This is definitely like a warm weather, cute little girly outfit. So we've got the West Coast Love, I think, um, white skort. Literally so cute. I think skorts are perfect for uni because you don't need to worry about anyone seeing your undies because you've got shorts. You know? And then this is the, I think it's the My Good Side tee. I just thought this would be so cute. I think it looks really cute with a skirt, but it would look really cute with a skirt and really cute with denim shorts and jorts and denim jeans and linen pants. I feel like there's just so many options with this top. Like it's one of those tops where you can go one top, 20 outfits. I just think there's a lot of potential outfits with this one and that's really what you want when you're purchasing outfits for uni. Like you want to be able to rewear them. Okay, next up we have the short temper ribbed tank top and the, oh my god, I literally just checked the name of this. Let me check. Okay. The Have You Been In Love high-waisted skirt. I know this looks like a sh like a short, but it's a skirt. I'm obsessed with her, this little white linen. I think that linen is just so good for uni because you can really wear it when it's warm, like in the form of like a skirt or shorts or pants. But you can also do like linen pants in winter, I feel like, with a cute sweater. So like there's a lot to work with there. Um, and I feel like this top is just so cute because again, what I'm trying to show you in this haul is that you can mix and match so many different things and this top would go so well with a pair of jeans or pants or shorts, everything. I'm actually obsessed and I love the color. I'm really in my like oat colored clothes color. But yeah, love this fit. I love this jumper jacket. Don't you worry pants. And I can't remember the life of me this jacket Sam. I literally just looked at it. Well known, the well known fleece jacket. First of all, I'm obsessed with this color combination. Like this is an outfit that I would 100% wear to uni because it's just so matchy. Like the black flares, with the grey and black, like, it's just so pleasing. It's giving sandwich. Um, but also, 
I love fleece. Like, fleece is my shit. It's so comfortable. It's not too thick, and it looks just so cute. I feel like I just look so... I don't know. I feel like this is a really cute outfit. Like, just imagine, like, walking around with a little coffee. Like this. My laptop. Bag. Oh, it's just a vibe. I just feel like this is, like, a really effortlessly cool outfit. It's very much giving uni student. Next up, we have the Only Fun and Games top. This top is so good. Like, I feel like for uni, like, you don't always want to wear, like, a super crop top or, like, a super booby top. You know, I don't know. Like, I just feel weird about it sometimes. Like, I like wearing practical clothing. But this top is just so perfect for uni. I think it's effortless. I think it's not conservative by no means but i think it's like slightly more modest than some of the tank tops and stuff that you see um which i personally find a bit more comfortable really good for layering as well like imagine this top with like a flannel on top or like a cute little jacket i just think it works really nicely it's just this ribbed white tank top high at the front high at the back which i really really like i think it's comfortable i think it's good for changing weather means you're not going to get sick as often or that's what my mum would say anyway I'm just obsessed with this. I think there's also the black one. I think I need it. Like, I'm a slut for a black tank top. If I open up my drawer that's full of basics, it's all black tank tops. And the worst part is I always wear the same one. <laughs> make it make sense. Let's add some white ones <laughs> to the collection. So, yeah, really like this one. Okay, now we have the Keep Making Moves tank top. And I forgot the name of the skirt again. <laughs> the best of friends mini skirt i think this skirt and i do have the potential to become the best of friends <laughs> this is like a i wouldn't say it's linen but it kind of feels like it like it's just that sort of vibe um it's very like casual it's giving off i could wear this on the daily i probably wouldn't wear it on like a night out but could definitely wear it to uni running errands i do think this would be really nice for those of you heading on a tropical vacay i just feel like it's very very comfortable and would look gorgeous with a pair of bikinis just got it on with sandals right now it looks pretty cute i like it and i like the fact that it has a drawstring as well because then you can make it fit you the way you want i'm wearing a size small in the skirt Honestly, I was kind of tempted to get a medium only because this style of skirt. I don't like it like tight around my hips It's a little bit tight around my hips, but I I just didn't I'm wearing a small it still fits perfectly. It's really good this top Extra small I get like everything else in this haul very matchable very versatile can dress it up can dress it down can wear it with different things Obsessed burgundy is one of my favorite all-time colors to wear like, this is just so pretty to me, and like, I don't know, it's giving off some of it, it's also giving off autumn and winter, I don't know. It's just a vibe. I really, really like this combination. Very cute. Guys, I don't know if you guys can see my hair being just weird, but my hair's just literally just fucked, I don't know what's wrong with it. It would not be a uni outfit haul if I didn't include a jumper, because let's be real... Majority of people just chuck on a hoodie in the morning and head to uni. Um, so you need some cute ones and White Fox is definitely the place to go for that. Um, this is the Moving Forward so hoodie <laughs> jumper. Um, this is literally so cute and it's not too thick. I think there's a time and a place for a thick hoodie and March is not it. I don't think it is in any part of the world. Like It's still warm and fluffy but it's not super like... <sighs> I could wear a jacket over this, you know, if I wanted to warm up a bit. But yeah, this is just so cute. I love the colours. This is this torpy colour is literally like my go-to colour at the moment. Like I'm obsessed. But I've just paired her up with some jeans. The with you jeans, of course. Um, but I think you could definitely like wear this with um with leggings. Leggings could be a vibe and even white linen pants. I could see that happening. Yeah, just very cute, very cozy. And I also don't like extremely big logos. And I feel like this little White Fox logo here, I feel like she's pretty subtle. She blends in, she matches. It's a vibe. I recommend. This is the ribbed temper tank top. It's just a ribbed white tank top. It's got a few buttons here. You might have already seen the oat colored one. I'm obsessed with it. This is my like favorite style of tank top. Um, just like open a little bit thick straps i would probably wear a bra with this one it's a little bit see-through i've got nipple covers on don't know if you can see that but um they're a little bit see-through um so keep that in mind i feel like if you got a black one you'd be fine i just think this is like the perfect top i'm currently wearing her with the with you jeans and they look stunning but also just imagine this with like nude beige colored 
linen pants that would be gorgeous or like just a pair of shorts or jorts oh my god jorts with this that would be so cute um but i just think it's really versatile i feel like at the moment because the weather is like shifting and changing so much this is we're going into autumn i feel like it's a really really good tank top and i feel like it's a time to be layering very very cute i'm obsessed with her okay i know you guys want to get back into the haul so remember ruby xo saved 15 percent off pinky promise me you'll use it Enjoy the rest of the video. It's a really good one. Bye. Feel the daylight on our skin. We are young. We feel everything. Yeah. So guys, I'm making lunch. I'm having a Thai beef salad, which is like my recent obsession. I've decided that growing up is lacking coriander because coriander's banging. I just think that not liking coriander is for children, you know? I'm just cutting up some chili. Sorry, this is a really bad angle, you can't see anything. I'm just, it's gonna fall, but I'm just cutting up some chili now, and then I'm gonna cook the steak, and then my salad will be ready. She's not much, but she's great. So guys, this is what my salad looks like. I feel like the lighting's not doing it justice. Yeah, this lighting's not doing anyone justice, but it's got lettuce, red onion, steak, Cucumber, coriander, red chili, some lettuce, and spring onion. And then I buy the dressing from Rolled, um, but I like add to it because it's a bit too fish saucy for my liking. Guys, hello, it's 3 p.m. My brain is well and truly fried, but I'm just hopping on to my evidence lecture. My evidence lectures are on Tuesdays, but I'm really not willing to drive to uni four times a week. Like, no, thank you. Um, that is so much petrol and my car is broken. I don't know if I told you guys this. My car is currently broken. I don't even have it at the moment. So I'm just hopping onto my lecture online. I'm a minute late. I always, you'd think that after four years, I'd remember how to get onto a class, but I forget every time. Like it's like, I see Zoom and I forget how to use it. I feel like it should be muscle memory by now. But yeah, so I'm just hopping on. Obviously, I don't want to invade anyone's privacy because they haven't given me consent to post them on YouTube. So we'll see how this goes. Recording in progress. I feel like no matter how many times you've used Zoom, you get scared every single time that your video is going to be on and your audio is going to be on, even though it's not. So um, I've just logged on. Oh my God, one of my friends is here. Do you reckon I can message her? I would love to say that I got something out of that class, but I listened for about 30 minutes and then I stopped listening because I got distracted editing my LTK shop, which is always like a spiral. Like once I start, I can't stop. And then it was like doing like problem questions and I'm really bad at doing problem questions like over a computer. So then I just, I clocked it up and then next thing I know it was 4.45 and class is over <laughs> and I didn't, I didn't get anything out of that. So get me. Second of a day is still happening. <laughs> My favorite breakfast. So excited. I didn't bring color. Well, so guys, I just made it to the gym. I was so determined to have like a really productive morning. And it has just been a slow morning. Like I woke up so sore from the gym. I've been sleeping really badly. So I just, yeah. It's just been a weird, weird few days. Driving my mum's car, which is kind of nice because she's got a high up car. I have a low down car, but my car's kind of shat itself. I'm kind of trapped at home at the moment and I feel really bad because I keep having to steal my mum's car um, while my car is getting fixed. Yeah, it's time to go gym. I can't be fucked at all. But you gotta do what you gotta do. All night till it dawn. Till it dawn, we light it up like. Find some clothes. 
going to have two coin covers for $9.80. It's a hair mask. No, man. It's I could put this on my covered. head when I have a shower. No, what is it? I have four packets on it. Can we go have a shower? Okay. Put this over my head. <laughs> Guys, it's oh. literally a hair mask. Oh, yeah. <laughs> your bowl. <laughs> Guys, I'm having a paint salad for lunch. It looks banging. It's gonna make me shit my pants. <laughs> so guys, I decided that I wasn't gonna go to uni. It, I only have one class, like, it's a lot of effort. And then we have to stay there till like seven. Um, so <laughs> I'm going to the post office. I'm going to the post office to pick up my package. Package picked up, this postman didn't even like knock on the door, which is like, it's annoying, first of all. And secondly, it's extra annoying because sometimes like I have deadlines and they've got like tight turnarounds, like for work. And I need my packages and then I can't do them. And then I'm like, oh, like the postman didn't knock on the door so I could get my package. Like, oh, the postman in my house, like actually just, he just never knocks at all. Like I literally come to the post office all the time. The ladies know by now. They're like, yeah, you're a driver. I found out that my, um, my car is going to cost me like a thousand dollars minimum. The part is like a thousand dollars to fix. I can't open this in the car, so I'll open it when I get home. Um, minimum a thousand, and like literally, like this is the worst timing. Like I had to like, I have like this mini like just procedure like thing next week, which is gonna cost me like three hundred dollars, and then I have to pay for sale Croatia as well. Like this is just fucked. Like if you guys see me like not doing anything, like it's because I just I can't right now. On a song recommendation, um, Shiver, John Summit, that fucking song. It's just so, just, I'm obsessed with, I parked this car so badly. This is so crooked. Do I, I should fix it. I think I'm going to do some work, guys. Now that I'm not going to uni, I shouldn't let myself rot for the day. So let's, I'll unbox, make myself look a little bit pretty. The lighting's not very good today, that's the only thing. But we'll try and make myself look uh, presentable. And then, yeah, I'll take you along. This is my dry shampoo from Justice Hair Care. I'm gonna film a video for them. I'll do it today. Okay, Slay, we have a dry shampoo, a mini dry shampoo, and a detangling brush. Guys, I need this. When I was in Europe, one of the girls on Contiki, Taylor, she's a hairdresser, um, and I was brushing my hair one night and she was like, what the fuck are you doing? Like when I brush my hair, like I'm just like, I love when brands send PR in like nice packages. Oh, okay. So we have collagen chewables, orange, picardu plum and berry, and chocolate. And then this bad boy is from Elite 11. The 11 shipping is always so on point. Aura Bond leggings, registered hoodie. So. <laughs> oh, this feels so soft. Yeah, Aura tea. I just filmed like a TikTok ad for Justice Hair Care for their dry shampoo. Did a little bit of research once they reached out to me and I was like, this sounds sick. Anyway, guys, this is amazing. Like you guys would have seen the state of my hair in the clips like just before this. Like, I'm sorry, but this is like giving like supermodel, like off duty supermo supermarket, <laughs> supermodel vibes. Like I'm actually obsessed. I am... Um, gonna be using this a lot more often probably a good thing that means goodbye to the constant slick backs but this is literally insane and it smells so good but i'm just about to change my outfit and log on to my lecture that i was meant to go on campus for i swear there's more security on my uni account than there is like for my instagram and tiktok like i don't even know why like what details could i possibly take um so this is what like my page looks like my student number like how far i am into my course yada yada and then we've got my unit so if you're wondering whoa your browser's looking a little retro i don't really have a choice right now babes okay here we go don't mind the princess polly at the back i need to do my selects for my march work always forget one day i'll remember how to get onto my classes i don't even know how i'm meant to get onto this class now. i can't watch my lecture live cool Cool, cool, cool. All right, that's fine. 
I am gonna... I'm gonna film a late 11 and then I'm gonna watch the Geelong waterfront, whatever, campus lecture, I think. And then next week I'll go on campus and I'll say which one I prefer. So guys, for those of you wondering what the behind the scenes of being an influencer, or as I prefer to call it, a content creator, um, I'm doing emails. Sorry, you can hear my entire family right now, but I'm doing my emails trying to set up some deals um trying to figure out invoices and like posting dates and stuff like that at the moment time has passed so fast it's been like an hour and i was like i need to do my lecture like i'm really like procrastinating right now so <laughs> awkward but yes yeah, so that's what i'm doing right now dinner is served hi guys so it's literally 6 56 and i still have not watched this lecture I could literally probably watch the Bellwood one, but I'm going to watch the Geelong one. I feel like if that's like the one that goes live, like maybe that's a better one. I don't know. But it's not so much. Uh, I'm an hour and nine minutes in. in. It is, is It is 9 p.m. and I'm an hour and nine minutes in. in such a way I should have just gone fucking uni. <laughs> then it's a chat What's oh, about that? Guys, I just did my makeup for uni i filmed the get ready of me on tiktok so that's why you guys didn't see me get ready i need to leave the house in like 10 minutes and i haven't even eaten <laughs> MS. guys we made it to uni um it's a little bit i'm a little bit early and i know where my class is i figured it out so i don't really know what to do with myself maybe get a coffee should i get one now i've got a lecture i've got a fusion <laughs> a little bang oh my god i just i should go it would be early then to be late. I wish I listened to that modern mod. Did I forget my laptop? No. Oh, thank God. Imagine if I forgot my laptop. I'd just turn around and go home. We're ready? Ah! I'm kind of nervous, but it should be fun. Guys, that wrap is like legit, like the best thing ever. I haven't felt joy like this. Like I just, I smell academic validation and iced coffee and I'm like, yes. Okay, so I just had my first seminar was for integrated marketing um i didn't film in there but one of my friends is in my class which is so good i'm so happy to see her i haven't seen her since like last year so i had to leave early though because i've got a class in the law building which is on the other side of campus and i didn't want to be late because it's like a class class and like what people have chosen their seats on me you know so i want to be there early. i need to go to bathroom i'm gonna piss my pants this coffee just run straight from me feel it daylight on our skin we are young, we feel everything. Yeah, it's starting. Do you want to say hi to the vlog? Hi. <laughs> I forgot to vlog today, sorry guys. To begin. So, this is my outfit. White box, Stradivarius, Puma, Sony. Words we were meant to sing. Close my eyes. I feel where we are. It's literally like, fuck me, what time is it? It's like eight o'clock and I'm leaving uni now, which is like fucked up, especially for a week. What week is it? Week two. But, because I'm going to Sydney next week for work, I'm trying not to fall behind because I'm currently in like a fall behind type situation. And then start looking at my assignments soon. It's a really warm night. Um, it's really nice. But I'm trying not to fall behind, and I'm behind right now. I still didn't even finish all my work. I tried to do it when I get home or early tomorrow morning, just because I kind of got a bit of a busy weekend. It's like looking like the last nice weather weekend. So I'm just like trying to enjoy that. I don't know. I've got a lot of work to do too, so it's really just a bit right now so guys i really started doing shit in the vlogging department i'll vlog tonight because i'm going out but mum and i are you say hi vlog are you gonna say hi to the vlog hi <laughs> um we uh went to the beach and honestly it's not like an overly like hot day um but yeah we went it was beautiful even the water and we found a car park in like the most perfect freaking spot it's a Saturday. Like, how did we even do that? I don't know, but we're slayed. Hopefully, this time, my car isn't broken. I really just can't take any more L's this week, so 
hopefully she's okay. this video and I realized that I never finished editing it so basically this is me just ending the video the clips you saw from night out I'm so sorry there wasn't more like live action from the night but it was a really fun night out um lots of free drinks which was nice my bank account appreciated it gonna end this vlog hope you guys enjoyed we're getting back into the swing of it um, let me know what you like, didn't like, what you want to see, and yeah, more weekly vlogs are coming very soon.